Listen closely, my brother. Life as a man differs greatly from that of women, and I need to give you a harsh reality check. As a man, you are not born with inherent value like women are. People will not automatically take care of you like they do with girls and women. You are not a prince, and people do not care about your weaknesses or financial struggles. In fact, many people may even take pleasure in seeing you struggle. In this video, I will give you the best advice you can possibly get if you want to create a good, meaningful life for yourself as a man. But before we get into it, please leave a like and hit that subscribe button. Thanks, brother. Now let's get going. In the modern world, a lot of people are trying to push the idea that men and women are the same. Do not be fooled by this nonsense. We lead very different lives, and if you are a man, not a single soul will show you any mercy. You should expect zero handouts and zero sympathy. Accept the reality that you are on your own. But do not whine about it. Like a coward, it is actually an advantage. Your looks and your mere existence hold no value at all, and you will not receive sympathy for being a loser. However, you possess greater potential than women. As a man, you can create your own value and rise to the top of the food chain. It will involve hard work, struggle, sleepless nights, and failures. But once you reach that level, other men will respect you, and women will flock to you. Women are blessed with their beauty, and they often receive attention and care for free. On the other hand, men are blessed with immense potential. Do not waste it. It will take time to become a high-value man, and others will underestimate you. Make them pay for it by unlocking your potential ruthlessly. But remember, it is going to be uncomfortable. Success is on the other side of discomfort. So leave comfort to the other guys. Let them waste away their lives and remain as weak little worms. Now your progress is going to make other people uncomfortable because it will confront them with their own failures. So, they will feel better about themselves if they can drag you down. Be aware of this when joining in time-wasting activities like playing video games. Remember, it is your choice to throw away your potential and you cannot blame anyone else. People may try to convince you that video games are beneficial or that you need to have fun, but look at your own life. Do you deserve to slack off? Are you financially independent? Are you respected by everyone? Are you absolutely shredded? If not, then you should not be wasting your time on things that are not going to get you closer to these goals. You may not like what I am saying, but deep down, you know it is true. Let me ask you a crucial question. What is the most important factor in determining a man's success? The answer is delayed gratification. Saying no to instant pleasure in order to gain a greater reward at a later time. Most people go for instant gratification, akin to a dog chasing a bone. They would rather level up in video games than in real life, rather be fapping than approaching women, and rather eat junk food than exercise. They are your competition, soft, lazy, and lacking discipline. Is that who you want to lose to? By using delayed gratification, you can destroy all of them. Quick and easy dopamine always leads to a peak followed by a drop. It may feel good in the moment, but you will feel worse later. Earning your dopamine, on the other hand, involves discomfort. A tough workout is not as enjoyable as playing video games and eating junk food, but the dopamine spike you get afterwards is worth it. Your overall levels of dopamine remain higher than before, while those who seek instant gratification experience a drop in their baseline levels. Life is about trade-offs. Do you want pleasure now and suffer later, or do you want to suffer now for a greater reward later? Take your pick. That's it for today's video, guys. Please do me a favor and leave a like and hit that subscribe button. Thanks for watching. I will see you next time.